Jenny Kostinow is well known in the Ontario College Athletic Association and has been recognized as the top league pitcher this season. Her hard work, dedication and leadership has inspired everyone. Jenny's got pretty much the entire game. I mean, there's no question about it. She's got an awesome rise ball and uh, her drop ball and her pitches are all working. She's already at the top of her game and it's a matter of her maintaining the top of her game as opposed to really getting a lot more proficient at it. Jenny's leadership is what keeps her grounded and focused. She also knows how important it is to have a successful veteran on the team. I've been here for as my fourth year, so it kinda, I just fit kind of into that position. I think it's always important to have someone to look up to. The people, like the older people that are on the team, they um, really help mold the younger people and just make sure everyone goes together. And I've met some of the best people in the entire world, and um, other than that, just, just I think it's just the people that I've met along the way. All the, all the players uh, respect her well as a person, but even more so as a pitcher. She brings a good work ethic. She comes out there every game. She is always in there pitching hard, whether she's having a good game or maybe not a go so good of a game. She's still giving it 100% all the time. You never see a letdown on her. This team has um, started with a real mix of veterans and rookies and it's been a learning experience since day one. And every single game, every single practice, this team has got better and better, always aiming towards our goal, which is at the OCAAs. We've now qualified for that, and now that we gotta go there and uh, hopefully come home with a medal and preferably gold in color. The women's fastball team did come home with a bronze medal from the OCAAs. Their coach, Brian Weller, won Coach of the Year, and they had two players named to the league All-Stars, one of them being Jenny Kostinow, who continues to add to her legacy at Mohawk College.